Hello Taurus, thank you for clicking on my channel. Welcome to the journey home. My name is Catherine and I live in Nova Scotia. This is your Zodiac Tarot forecast for whenever you clicked on the title for the week ahead. Whenever you clicked on the title at the time it intrigued you. And we're going to start with a message from your angels, guides, guardians and ancestors. And this would be the most important message of the entire reading simply because it's your spiritual guided message. But just to let you know, I go live every Wednesday and Sunday night at 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. If you would like to join us for the party, I like pulling free cards for people who show up. There's a lot of perks for members at the website as well. So do check it out in the description below this video. So let's get started with the message from your guides and guardians. Oh, there is this path opening up. It is one that you haven't traveled before. And it seems rather mysterious and magical to you. Almost like a, that giddy childish feeling. Like, wow, I can't believe this path opened up. But you've never been down this path before. It's like blazing new trails and making discoveries along the way. Like magic. You are being circled by your ancestors right now who applaud you support you guide you encourage and where they are look at this you're doing some deep diving this is about going into the womb of the earth or into the darkest parts of your soul the sweat lodge purging purging old enemies old enemies yeah, very well could be. Old energies. But the wisdom that you've gained, we have the tree of life. And as you can see, there's two trees intertwined. This is about becoming whole. Both halves of your brain. You and a soulmate. You and your purpose. And this is something you'll want to rewind to listen to again by the time we finish this. So let's have a look at this spread. We have you moving. You're going through an ascension here. Moving to calmer waters. Going towards abundance. Wanting to leave behind that desert. And, and you're doing that. You want Here's your card. Hierophant. Taurus energy. Wanting something more meaningful. This is about can also be about signing contracts. Either spiritual or physical contracts. You know, like a major purchase. Uh, a major partnership or something spiritually wanting something more meaningful in a relationship here you are taking control of your life making things happen this could be someone around you as well uh, Taurus that is already established and wants to build empires with you Aries energy we have the messenger of air transformation and the aid of air so we have a message that came in. It could have been an ending of a relationship. A message that's coming in that is just going to um, put an end to things. It's, it's going to make you feel stuck. It's not a pleasant message. It's going to cause you to withdraw your energies and um, for the sake of not arguing. Uh, there is argument here. Tit for tat. This is like the pause before the pirouette before you knock out all these energies that are challenging and putting obstacles in your path in order to have emotional fulfillment within your home, your family. So whatever this message is, it's going to shake you up. And it's going to change things, the whole dynamic of, the, of a situation. And because you feel stuck, you're withdrawing. I think there's going to be a decisive moment here, though, that you're going to say enough is enough. End it. Transform your life in order to have this emotional fulfillment, which is more meaningful because at the beginning of the reading, it says you are moving towards those calmer waters, towards something more meaningful and empire building. We're going through a shift, aren't we? Six of air is going to be clarified with wisdom. Again, this is your card. This is the same as the Hierophant. 
moving to something more meaningful, more productive, more solid. Hierophant is being clarified by choose wisely. So you have opportunities opening up to you. It could be that this message caused a lot of confusion for you that's coming in, but it's, it shows that you have these paths that you can choose. But look at here, Taurus, you have your guides guiding you as to which is the path to take the most meaningful path. And as we saw at the beginning of your spiritual me message, it's not a path you've traveled before, but it is magical. I think something is, it, it, you know, it's going to intrigue you. Whatever this is that's coming or opening up, it's going to absolutely intrigue you and it's going to feel magical. I'll crack these cards. The Emperor is being clarified with partnerships and alliances. Yes, something more meaningful. This could be in business, partnering up with someone to be more productive in building this empire. It can be about love as well. However, that might re resonate for you, Taurus. Messenger of air is being clarified with the universe. So this isn't this message that's coming in is going to end something. This message is going to change the whole dynamics. But it also opens up this path where you can go in any direction you want. However, there is one path that your guides want you to take. If you don't choose this path that your guides are trying to push you towards, it doesn't mean you'll ever not take it. It just means if you choose a different path, it's only going to delay the inevitable of something very meaningful in your life. Material harvest at the heart of the reading. Now this either means, uh, Taurus, that you didn't get what you expected and it changes everything. You have to restructure your finances, your books. This can also mean a material harvest that comes in that allows you to make this complete change in your life. You know, to be able to you know, purchase that home or that car. Sacral chakra, feeling stuck. You're also feeling um, <laughs> sexually frustrated. Feeling stuck, wanting to move forward, wanting that sensual partner. Uh, you've withdrawn your en energies, but we have the chariot here, triumph conquering victory whatever this is i think it's because of the frustration of you know sexuality or wanting something romantic and sensual here you are conquering the city almost by non-action moving on yeah when this argument ends this Whatever is coming to surface that is going to change everything, you're going to move towards peace. Absolute peace, tranquility, leveling up, getting rid of these obstacles into smooth sailing. You're ascending. Look at this. This emotional fulfillment of the home has everything to do with the zero point field which is the magic of the magic, new beginnings, taking a leap of faith, trusting yourself and achieving that emotional fulfillment in the home, your surroundings, your life mate. Let's finish this reading with some advice for your love life. What is the advice for Taurus regarding love? Advice for Taurus regarding love. The 
This can also be turned around too. If you're inquiring about uh, a certain someone, it could be them that's feeling stuck and <laughs> sexually frustrated. Taurus, we have chemistry that came up face up first. There's a strong magnetic attraction here. You need to release some energies here. This says release your ex. It does not necessarily mean releasing your ex. It means you need to clear your energies of the past. If you're hanging on to resentment or bitterness, let it go in order to move forward. Or maybe if this is about someone that you are inquiring about, you need to let them walk their own path. We cannot control the destiny of others. Forgiving and learning. As you release and heal the past, you'll be experiencing more love in the present moments. And look at this. You've been calling in your soulmate. Getting to know each other. This is about new love. And if this is about uh, you being in a commitment already, you're leveling up to a uh, higher level of understanding each other. And this says, as you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. If that resonated for you at all, Taurus, please do hit the like, share, subscribe. Check the description below this video for all the information you need and all the perks that are available to you at the website and here at this channel. God bless you, and I hope to talk to you again soon. Bye-bye for now.